But we begin tonight with breaking news. A march to the Seattle mayor's neighborhood. Tonight, hundreds of people gathered at Magazine Park before making their way toward Mayor Jenny Durkin's home. Carol Simmons' Gary Horker kicks off her team coverage of protest tonight. And Gary, this was quite a large crowd. Yeah, the crowd marching into and around the mayor's house in a gated community was large enough to fill an entire city block. Some estimates of thousands of people. We're not going to show you exactly where the mayor lives because we need to remind people her address is protected by state law confidentiality. And I'm going to get out of the way. We understand some of the protesters are coming towards us. We are not far from Magnuson Park right now. Now, the mayor has reminded people where she lives is part of the state confidentiality program after she received threats from her years of work as U.S. attorney dealing with drug cartels. Now, this crowd of protesters, and there were estimates of 2,000 people loudly marching into the gated neighborhood where the mayor lives as darkness fell tonight with full throated chants about their demands to defund police, demands to reform justice. Justice system demands that she resign. They brought along a very large, loud sound system, noisemakers, cowbells, music. There's no doubt the entire neighborhood heard uh, that noise and heard that disruption. After an hour long rally, they paraded right past the mayor's gate where we're told police officers lined the driveway. There's a lot of sensitivity about demonstrators here because uh, member, Council Member Shama Sawant led a group of protesters here. The mayor called for a full council investigation of Sawant. The mayor said the council member acted, quote, with reckless disregard for the safety of her family. Now, we did not see. The, the route, the parade or marching route, if you will, aligned by police officers as you usually do downtown. They were very quiet actually here. And we don't even know as a practical matter if the mayor and her family are in their gated home for the holiday weekend. But reaction will be uh, probably pending on this. We'll keep an eye on it for you and report it throughout the weekend. We understand the crowd is streaming out back towards Magnuson Park right now. Reporting live near Magnuson Park, I'm Gary Horker, Cairo 7 News.